What's up everyone? Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Before we begin, make sure to hit the like and subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button which is the bell icon. We're posting four videos every day so make sure to check back every single day. We're aiming for 20k subscribers and get a deal in the description if you haven't already. This is not financial advice. Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Let's begin. What's up guys, so just before we begin, make sure to hit the subscribe and bell icon. People aren't seeing our content and that's probably because you haven't hit the bell. Thank you again for all your support. We're so proud of the amazing community that we've built. So we're just taking a look at Ethereum here and as we can see, really, really nice little pump over the past few days. We're coming up to our price target, which we have been mentioning for a few days now. We would say this is exactly as predicted, to be honest, about what's been going on with Ethereum recently. We did say it would consolidate once it headed over this previous range that it was in, looking something like this. Where we basically come down, didn't we? We double bottom, we come back up, we break out of the range, we consolidate above resistance for a good while, we're holding the 20th support, all exactly as predicted. And then we did say if we started to break out of this level here, we would be heading up to around the next resistance at around $3,600. And it does look as though we have pretty much, you know, come up to around that level, we're at 3,500, 3,532. At the time recording this video, and it looks as though we, we headed up to a high of around 3,570 before having a little bit of a pullback. If we just take a quick look here on the hourly chart, you can see what's going on. We have actually broken out of the range that we were talking about. We broke out, came down, retested. We came up again, broke out, retested the breakout perfectly as support, pumped up again, came down, retested the breakout again as support. And then since then, we've started to grind our way up over the past 24 hours or so, haven't we? And you can see quite clearly on a daily chart, <clears throat> things looking very good indeed. If we draw in this next range that we have made here, something like this, where essentially, you know, it looks as though Ethereum has been ranging for the past two or three weeks, or this is around two weeks, we would say, which we think is absolutely ideal considering the huge pump that we had here. We really did need to see Ethereum cooling off a bit before another move because we do want to see, you know, a bit more consistency in the price action and not too much parabola because you can see here, this is pretty much a straight line up on the chart, isn't it? And in reality, we did want to see ourselves cooling off a bit before another move because we don't want to get too overextended. Because, you know, if you can go up this fast, then you can go down straight this fast as well. So it's nice to see Ethereum come up like this and not just fall straight back over, which shows, you know, the massive amount of strength that it's got. Obviously, with the IP1559 now as well, it's very deflationary or at least more deflationary than it was before. Lots of Ethereum being burned on transactions. And it generally, you know, it looks like Ethereum has got a lot of strength in the market in general. So we obviously came up out of this uh, big range that we formed here. Over the past few months with that double bottom, we bounced up, we got our flip of the bullish EMAs. Ever since then, the 20 has been holding its perfect support. We come all the way up to the top of uh, this previous resistance here. We rolled over, retested that previous level of resistance as support of that previous range high. Really bullish to see. We come up again. We try and break out of this little mini range that we formed here. You can see it here on our uh, on our daily time frame. We come up again, but we can't break the range. We come back again down, test pretty much that, you know, in and around that 3K level of support. But more or less, we're just testing the 20th support here, aren't we? We bounce up again. You know, we have a bit of an indecision candle here where we touch the top of our range again. We come back down for one last test of the EMA at the 20. The 20 EMA here on the daily time frame. And then since then, the rest is history, really, isn't it? You can see we've got a nice little pump yesterday outside the range. And it looks as though we've retested that previous range of support here. And now we're just having a bit of a nice run up, aren't we? Currently around $3,530. Looking very, very nice for a bit of continuation, which is really, really good to see, isn't it? It's pretty obvious in our opinion that Ethereum is well on its way to doing some really good stuff. And you can see, I mean, it's showing so much strength there, isn't it? We're, we're pretty much aiming after this resistance as well for that 4K level. And then upwards of that, after that, it's the all time high, isn't it? Because things are looking really strong. So. Ethereum looking really good, having a nice pump today, as we can see on the chart. We did see our next level to be looking for is around that $3,600 level, which does look as though it's about to be hit uh, probably today. We'll probably see a decent amount of resistance there because there is a decent order block here of resistance and uh, a previous bit of support as well. So we do expect a bit of a pullback from there, maybe to roll back and retest this previous little range as support, maybe consolidate a bit before another go at it. But you know, Ethereum looking really, really strong, isn't it? So now that we've established what's going on we'd say for short-term price predictions if ethereum starts to roll over obviously we've, we've got this uh this now previous resistance flipped into support so if we come down and test this as support that would be really bullish wouldn't it around three thousand three hundred and fifty dollars 
If we do lose that, we've obviously got the 20, which is coming up like this as well, which would probably coincide quite nicely with that previous level of resistance flipped into support as well. And then, as we said, if we do fall back inside this range, we've always got the 55 now coming up with the bottom of the range and it will slowly start making its way up like this if we were to roll over from the, the 20, coming back down to the 55. But it does seem like with Ethereum being in such a strong uptrend right now, with the 20 acting as very strong support, we'd probably um, we'd probably say over the next few days, if Ethereum does roll over and touch this again, that the 20 would be a nice bounce. And obviously we said 3,600 as our next level of resistance. But if we just got a huge pump and started pumping out of this level as well, we've also got coming up to 3,900 to 4K as decent price targets for the short term as well. So those would be our short term price predictions. And then in the long term, as we always say, if we're going into November, December, January time for the end of the bull run, which we think we probably will be, considering how long we've consolidated here, we would say realistically, if we hit the top of our channel, you know, we're looking at at least 10K for Ethereum here. If we take a look at what we would be if we hit the top of our channel here, Going into December, we're looking at 10 to 15K. And if we head into January as well with the rest of the pump, we could be looking at 20K for Ethereum. So that's it, guys. We'd like to thank everyone so much for their support. If you've got any questions or suggestions, please leave them down below. And don't forget to subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button, which is the bell icon to stay up to date with the four videos that we post every single day. Remember, if you want to support the channel more directly and get a ton of benefits and insight, as well as joining our growing community, consider the Patreon or YouTube membership down below. You can also sign up to our free Telegram via the description as well. All the links are in the description for affiliate links for discounts and free crypto, so go check them all out below. There's plenty of goodness on offer. Please like and subscribe. We are Crypto Maximalists.